Hey, what's going on, y'all? Me, Brandon Robinson here. Um, so YouTube has this new YouTube editor thing where you're supposed to be able to edit videos directly from YouTube, and uh, I just decided to mess around with it for a little bit, and I was trying to come up with a new, uh, like a creative little video to show off all the different things you can do on it, and uh, that's when I discovered you really can't do much of anything on it. Now, it has potential. They have a trim option where you can, uh, you know, kind of trim up the video. But the issue I have with that is the fact that. Sorry, throat's kind of whatever. Um, the issue I have with that is that you really don't have very many options with the trimming. Um, they have like a clip bar um, that you drag to the point that you want to clip. But let's say that there's something in the middle of the video that you want to trim out, like you want to make a jump cut or something, uh, with this YouTube downloader thing, or the YouTube editor thing, um, you really can't do that. You drag it to wherever you want it, and it cuts out everything from that point and before. So let's say from 1 minute and 2 seconds to 1 minute and 4 seconds you have a pause that you want to cut out. You can't do that without cutting out everything before 1 minute and 4 seconds, at least from what uh, I've seen of it. Now, I really didn't mess with the audio, so I can't talk about the audio, but uh, <coughs> they also have video effects. Um, like, let's say you want to make it a black and white video, or you want to make it pixelated or something. Um, that's an option, but um, if, if you want the effect, you better want it for the entire video, and you better not want to use any other effects. Like, for example, I'm probably going to be using an effect on this just to make it a little more appealing to the eye. Um, I'm unable to switch to any other effects, and it's going to last the entire video because I can't really pick and choose. Now, I think, and I can't believe I'm saying this because I bitch about the program all the time, but... If YouTube Editor were to uh, take a lesson or two from Windows Movie Maker, um, then I think that it might be really convenient. Um, for example, if, if they make the trim options uh, a little more customizable, because I believe that uh, being able to trim the video directly on YouTube, that'll definitely be really nice. So make it to where you can trim out what you want, make that a little easier. Make it to where you can pick and choose when you want certain effects. Um, basically, take a page or two out of Windows Movie Maker's book. Because um, the way it is right now, it's very basic, it's very primitive. And I mean, this is the first time I've ever seen it pop up, so I'm not expecting it to be the top program or anything. I'm not expecting it to be better than Windows Movie Maker. But uh, right now, as it is, I wouldn't recommend using it. Um, use iMovie or Windows Movie Maker or whatever you're using right now because this is still in its infancy and it still has a lot of work to do. Brandon Bronson, signing out.